what's up everybody welcome back to my channel my name is kai and i'm back with another video so in today's video first off to start i just want to tell y'all that for these twists they still look nice still look juicy i used emerge hair care line i'll show y'all it's about halfway going already because I love this product. It's $6.99 at Target. If you want a cheap, affordable, moisturizing curling cream. What is this? Buttercream? Buttercream curling cream for your hair. And this is the only product that I use for these twists. So, Emerge. Target. $6.99. Alright, so let's get right into this video. So today I'm going to talk about products that I would never ever 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 forever ever we purchase again like never i have a couple here so we might be here well i'm, I'm gonna make it quick i'm gonna make it quick so the first one is by style factor yes style factor i love style factor edge booster but this product here i don't really think it's for me so i wouldn't repurchase it and it is the what is this first of all? Style Factor Hideout Natural Black in the color Natural Black. And it's not an edge control. If you can see that, it's actually black. And um, I think this is for thinning edges. And I would not repurchase this because my edges aren't thinning. I just don't. This is something that I would not buy or even think about buying because my edges aren't thinning. This is for like, you know, thinning edges or something like that. And that's not what I have. So the next product is Blueberry Bliss, Blueberry Bliss Con Curl Control Paste. Now, I've tried this many times, as you can see, and it's still full. It just doesn't work on my hair. This just doesn't work. I'm glad that I didn't buy it and it was sent to me, but would I buy this in the store if I was in Target? Absolutely not, because it doesn't work on my hair. The next product is Cream of Nature Pure Honey Moisture Whip Twisting Cream. It looks like this. Now, this smell is amazing, but the moisture is not there. And the only reason it's down that low is because... What happened? The only reason it's down this low is because I think this was the only product I had to use. I wasn't a natural hair YouTuber yet, so I was just going with the motions. And, you know, I couldn't really afford to buy products like that, so I had to use what I had, honey. So, um, yeah... That's the only reason why it's down that low. I do not reach for this anymore, though. Another one from Cream of Nature. The smell is awesome. Like I said, the smell on both of these is awesome. But this was not moisturizing at all. And this is the same thing. I don't use liquid leave-ins. It's the Strength and Shine Leave-In Conditioner. I don't use liquid leave-ins. The only time I will use a liquid leave-in is on protective styles. Like if I have really, really, really long braids. And I don't protective style anymore. So I would not buy this at the store if I had a sandwich. If I had money for a sandwich and money for that hair product, I'd pick the sandwich. So the next one is Eco, the coconut one. Again, smells amazing, but okay. <laughs> so uh, the only reason why I really would not buy this is because the smell, you know how smells remind you of certain people that you don't really want to remember? This smell reminds me of my ex-boyfriend because this is the gel that I used to use when I was with him and it just you can just it just toxic toxic so i don't want this smell anywhere near my nose and i don't really think it did much for my hair this was like when i first first 
first went natural like five years ago so yeah and then i first met my boyfriend five years ago too my ex-boyfriend so yeah this reminds me of him the scent and i don't want to be reminded of him so <laughs> yeah another one is good hair by uncle funky's daughter the conditioning styling cream this is what it looks like i really like the brand uncle funky's daughter but this product to me smells like bananas it smells like bananas and i don't like the smell of bananas i hate bananas so that's why this product is in this video love the line I love Uncle Funky's daughter, but this product right here smells like bananas and I do not like bananas. So, yeah. Now, the next one is another one by Eco. It's the Cannabis Sativa Black Caster and Olive Oil. This did nothing for my hair. Um, it smells kind of earthy, I guess. Okay, let's close that but um this did nothing for my hair nothing okay and oh i cannot stand this stuff right here murray's edge wax i use this this does not work on edges okay the only reason why it's down this low is because i used it on my protective when i was protective styling at the time when i had you know when i would have those really really long braids that's how i would um i'll put some on here and then you know lock the hair in and braid it down yeah this stuff is a no if you're gonna use this on edge on your edges do not waste your money please it does not work and I've had that for a while. I think I've had that for over two years. But I, I want to put it in. I wanted to put it in this video. So the next one is Miss Jessie's so Jelly Soft Curls. This product right here. First of all, I would not purchase this because of the price point. I feel like this is way too expensive. To like why? Why? It's way too expensive and it just doesn't work for my hair i might try it again but it doesn't work for my hair now i did not buy this this was my who gave this to me my sister my sister actually gave this to me and uh yeah Again, this was before I even started my YouTube channel, before I even thought about starting a YouTube channel. So um, she gave this to me because it didn't work on her hair. So this didn't work on my hair either. So yeah. Miss Jessie's Jelly Soft Curls. I think this is the only product that I have from them too and I didn't even buy it. So yeah. Another product that I would not purchase is this True Hydrating Edge Gel. It looks like this. it just doesn't work um as you can see it's sh it shifted you see that this stuff don't get this it doesn't as soon as you put it on it's like why did i even do that don't don't buy this please don't buy that another thing that i would not repurchase again i would not even reach for in the stores is true by made beautiful co-wash cleansing cleanser this has not even been opened this was sent to me as well as this their whole line was sent to me actually um i would not buy this because i don't co-wash so this has never been open as you can see like it's never been oh is there a seal on this Oh, there's no seal on this, but it's never been open. So, um, I might give this to one of my nieces or something because I don't co-wash. I'm low porosity. I need a cleanser, something that's going to get the buildup off of my scalp. So, and co-washes just don't work for me. So, yeah. 
another thing that i would not buy is the wig out hair shine spray by style factor this was sent to me as well and um i i love the way it smells but i just i don't use like it smells amazing but i'm just gonna give this to my mom because my mom is still permed and she uses you know sprays like this and yeah i don't i just don't use shine spray i, I just i if i want my hair to be shiny i'll either use a curling cream that i know is going to be moisturizing or i'll put an oil on my hair and boom shine i i don't use shine spray and the last product that I would never repurchase again is the Curl Essence Moisturizing Cocoa Water. It's kind of beat up. Number one, the packaging. I thought it was cute, but now it's like, can y'all see that? It's all like, you can't even, eventually, you, you're not even going to be able to tell what this is. But this is the Moisturizing Cocoa Water with Jamaican Black Castor Oil and Coconut Oil. I think you're supposed to use this instead of water. I think it's a, is this a refresher? I don't know, I don't know what this is, but I only bought it because it said cocoa water and I wanted to try it with the curling cream that I have of this line as well. But I just feel like it did nothing to my hair. It's just, I don't feel like it did anything extra powerful to my hair and i don't like wasting money or time using a product and it doesn't work you know what i mean that that just i feel like i wasted my time well i kind of did pretty much didn't because it's in this video and i can tell y'all not to buy it but yeah um i would not repurchase this product because it wasn't moisturizing it didn't do anything and i'm just better off using water actual water in my spray bottle so yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching thank you so much for supporting thank you so much for subscribing if you have not already please subscribe to my channel and um y'all don't buy these products i mean if you want to go ahead try it but don't buy these products <laughs> Um, but yeah, that's all I have for y'all. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe all the day on the road to 400 subscribers and 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, and so on and so forth. So I will see y'all in my next video. Bye. Oh, wait, wait. Thumbnail. My my channel gets all the bloopers, like, for real. My channel legit. Let me see. Okay, I need to do a stank face because I really don't like these products. Like, I. Alright, y'all. So, I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.